look at someone and they are living a life that we want to live firstly bless them the blessings if it was like a boomerang that every time you bless someone from somewhere else the same blessing comes back to you when you are in a happy state then you wish everybody happiness when you are in a jealous negative angry sad state that's what we start to send out in the world how to stop comparing my happiness and freedom with my husband's and feeling jealous oh i think the most important thing to understand from jealousy is the feedback that you are seeing someone having something that you want so your immediate need or action needs to be how can i start to take my life to a place where I too can choose to live the life like his. So instead of pulling him down to not have that, see if you can raise yourself to having that. I remember about a year ago we were watching a lady in Vedanta speak about different kinds of life, tamasic life, rajas rajas life and um satvic life. So she was speaking about how tamasic people are just negative lazy people rajas are people who are chasing the world for building their careers very busy burnt out but you know um, enjoying the significance that they are getting enjoying the money that they are making but in that rut where they have no time and space for anybody or for love or for relaxing or for so it's a it's like a hamster on a wheel right and then there are the satvic people who's serving the world with with without losing their peace and being remaining happy and as we were watching it at that point i was doing back to back sessions every day master classes and this and that and i was like i am in a rajas mode i was telling my husband that you know you and i are in rajas mode both of us are so busy building our lives and he just turned around and said i'm not i play golf 3 times a week i'm doing exactly i'm living the life of my dreams and i just turned around to him and i said but i'm not i'm in rajas i'm like just i feel like the only thing i'm doing is making money and he said then you see what you need to do and in that moment i felt so jealous and oh wow he's been sitting in satvic mode and here i am in rajas and what am i doing with my life and i really sat down reflected and redesigned my life and it took me about 6 months to really decide what it is that i want and what is it that had just started to happen because my children left for uh, the uk and suddenly i felt like i have so much time tv se to better hai kaam hi kar lo and so the reason i kept giving myself was tv se to better hai kaam hi kar lo tv se to better so mai kaam karte gayi karte gayi karte gayi to realize one day ke my life had become my work and that's all the, the that was the only dimension i had at that point so So for you to come back to your question my sweetheart I want you to know that when we look at someone and they are living a life that we want to live firstly bless them why should we bless them because what we send negative to we send a signal to god that I don't like that so do not bring that into my life we have to do the reverse any time you're feeling jealous of someone instead I would love for you to bless them for the minute you send them blessings that means the blessings if it was like a boomerang i want you to imagine every blessing as a boomerang that every time you bless someone from somewhere else the same blessing comes back to you which is the first reason why i tell people keep blessing people the more negativity you feel towards someone or just bless them ki bhagwan ji inko khush kar do inko jahan jana hai jao but khush kar do acha kar do inke liye you know because negative people we normally don't bless so just bless your husband for living that life and then start to create your life in accordance it may take you 3 to 6 to 6 months to a one year but you know what in a year's time you'll be exactly where you need to be and how lovely will that be when both the spouses are happy earlier on in my marriage i used to pull my husband down acha aapke paas friends ke liye time hai gym ke liye time hai golf ke liye time hai bas mere liye time nahi hai what am i doing everything that gives him happiness i'm saying leave and be with me a person who's nagging him is he going to enjoy being with me am i going to enjoy being with him absolutely not but when i started to encourage him to go to the gym encourage him for golf encourage him with his friends and said but wednesday dinners are mine he was more than happy to give it to me because i stopped being victim and i started to ask for what i desire or what is it i want and i think too many of us especially women are spending too much time talking about what we don't want we need to shift our energy to what we do want and the more you speak of what you do want will that will start to come into your life and very soon you'll see yourself living a life of you know happiness and when you are in a happy state then you wish everybody happiness when you are in a jealous negative 
angry, sad state, that's what we start to send out in the world. Yeah.